Going to take lots of pictures here at Red Shores at the Summerside Raceway. As the second race lines up behind the Metro Home Building Center starting gate, let's go upstairs to Vance Cameron. Lights out. Equal dignity, Mahal Beach. Darlington, Hanover, good gracious, Eileen. TL's Betty, top of the stretch. Here they come. There they go, off and pacing. TL's Betty leaving out. Darlington, Hanover towards the rail. That's equal dignity as they race over to the opening gate. Off stride, Darlington, Hanover's on the run on the turn. Equal dignity will lead it. Second is TL's Betty coming up after the leader. Third towards the rail. That is lights out. Then racing fourth, Mahal Beach. Fifth along the inside is Good Gracious Eileen. Then the trailer. That is Darlington, Hanover. So along the back stretch, going to the opening quarter, the post-time favorite TL's Betty for Adam Murner is the leader. Racing from second, that's equal dignity. Into the turn, lights out is third. The quarter was 30 seconds flat. Racing from fourth, Maho Beach, then fifth. On the turn is good gracious Eileen. The gapped out trailer is Darlington Hanover. Off the paddock turn, they come towards the opening half mile. On the point, TL's Betty, the fraction's at her. Racing from second, in at the rail, that's equal dignity. Now in third is lights out. Racing from fourth, Maho Beach. Fifth is good gracious Eileen. And the trailer, that's Darlington Hanover. 60 seconds flat. They arrived at the opening. Opening half mile. Over to the 5 8 they go. And on the front end, TL's Betty leads. Equal dignity. Lights out goes third. Maho Beach is in fourth. That's good gracious Eileen fifth. And on the outside, the trailer, Darlington Hanover. Three quarters comes next. And TL's Betty will lead them there. Equal dignity sticks with the leader. Well back to third is lights out. Then in fourth, Maho Beach. Three quarters in one. 29 until they are scattered and I mean scattered they're homeward bound now TL's Petty the leader second is equal dignity lights out is third as they come to the wire next TL's Petty needs the line equal dignity up the inside but it's TL's Petty in line to Adam Murner second is equal dignity lights out will finish third time for the mile 158 Three. And first call for 50-50. Lynn is up here right now in the oval. First call for 50-50 as we get a look at the slow-mo replay for this evening's second race. And we saw T.L.'s Betty go to the front 30, the half up in a minute. Down to three quarters in one, 29 and two. And comes home 29 and one to stop the clock in 158 and three. That is a new race win record for this three year old filly by Pang Shui. Equal dignity. Good effort from her up the inside for second. Lights out in her first lifetime start is third. And the three Maho Beach is fourth. So six, two, one, three unofficially in tonight's second race. We'll see TL's Betty in the winner's circle next. Much like the backstretch beat said in the program, gets better and better every week. And she is this night in Summerside. That's TL's Betty here in the second. Bay Pacing Philly 3 by Pang Shui off the Camlock Dam Goddard's Art. Owned by Jeffrey Campbell from Judique, Nova Scotia. Trained by Melissa Rennie and driven to victory by Adam Murner. 
the mile 158 and 3. That's a new pacing record on 6 TL's Betty in the second. 